Where are we headed? Whew. Utah, Idaho. First race, race of the season. Whew. How are you feeling? Pretty good. Ready to get on the road. Update, where are we? What time is it? How are we feeling? Utah. Just crossing the mountain time, so we lost an hour. But making good time so far. So just gotta go from the bottom of the state now up to the top. Easy. We're on the drive up to Utah. It's like 12 hours from our house from Phoenix and totally we're winging it. Um, need to find a place to run and happened upon this trail in, uh, where are we, Spanish Fork? And it's beautiful. It's perfect weather. We're out of the heat. It's race week. Good morning. Oh, Good morning. <laughs> there's a mirror. <laughs> tuck, tuck. Hi. How'd you sleep? I made it pretty good. Just having a bit of coffee, get everything going, and we are at our Airbnb or Vacasa or whatever it is, and it's pretty nice. It's not too bad. The view's great. Excited to go out and explore the town. I got to sleep in for the first time in a little while, and it's still kind of chilly out, so I like to, I like to race in the cold and train in the cold, so this will be good. It's a nice change from the heat that we have, but we'll see how the altitude feels. On this cute little breakfast place. We always find the good spots. That's a pretty good crepe. Not as good as the one we had in France, but I'll take that. And we get a view of the lake over there. Yeah, we've missed traveling and trying the different foods. <laughs> yeah, we always tend to find the local spots. So this is a good one. And yeah, it's going to be fun to, to get out there and see more of the town. Tucker. So what are you um, eating? What is in here? It's like a veggie crepe with an egg in there and a little bit of cheese. Wow. Looks good. Flushing the legs, getting them all loosened up. Gonna go do some pre-race workouts, just some sharpening stuff. Had a long car ride yesterday, so just waking everything up and yeah, loosening, breaking some uh, soreness up, all that, just getting ready to, to go work out. Bike is all set. I just got done with a swim. Um, beautiful lake here, it was awesome. It's crystal clear, a um, little chilly, but the wetsuit helped. Um, feeling pretty good over. I haven't swam in my wetsuit in a little while uh, out in open water and always good. Love the Dubor wetsuit. Goggles were great, like, yeah. I think this is a great venue. Once you get out there, it doesn't really go deep super fast, but Overall, it's a, it's a really, really cool lake. One of the coolest ones to swim in, it's so flat. So will it be hard to get a good start if it's flat for a while? Well, that's just where this beach is. Our beach is down a little bit. So the, I mean, the water is the same, but how the uh, sand goes down might be a little different because it's, it's kind of flowing. It looks like it can come up higher. So um, I don't know, we'll see. We might have to go down there and, and try it out. The strategy would be like this into the water. Yeah, exactly. Can I show everybody how, how what's the strategy like? like this. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> all right. Tucker's all good too. He wants to go play in the water.
after some priming efforts yesterday and then before activation tomorrow. Um, my coach and I are just big on rest and letting the body you know, be ready to, to be able to deliver. So we're taking this opportunity of not having as much to do to go out and drive the course to get an idea for road conditions, make sure that I have an idea of what the corners look like and just have a general idea of what the course um, is gonna be like on race day.